If I wanted to be free of something and I asked the Lord to actually take it and I gave it up, he always takes it. So for those that are dealing with fear or depression tonight and the Lord convicts you of that, because here's the thing, anxiety, depression starts as anxiety, usually. And the Bible says to be anxious for what? It doesn't say, hey, pray about it and let's just see what happens. He says, be anxious about nothing, but pray about everything. Give thanks for all that he has done. And then, say then. Amen. Then his peace that passes all understanding. See, we were like, hey, will you pray for peace that passes understanding? I'm really dealing with anxiety. <laughs> what you're saying is, hey, can I get a break? But if you're like, you know what, I really do have anxiety. I haven't had peace in a long time. The Bible says peace that passes all understanding, so it's not going to make any sense to me. So it also says that I can have joy unspeakable. I don't even know what that means. That's the point. If you can understand your God, that's not, he's not a God. <laughs> I don't even know what I said. What? If you can understand your God, he's not God. And you know what I think about? I think about, I think about in, I think about in Acts chapter 7 when, when Stephen is standing there. Don't you know Stephen had a spotlight on him? And what did Stephen do? Stephen didn't try to cast out a demon from Saul. What did Stephen do? Stephen preached from the, from the beginning. Stephen was like, I'm a, how much time I got? Okay. I'm going to start in Genesis. <laughs> Because Stephen started all the way up. Because God is so good that he never cha- he's never different. It's, he's perfect at the beginning and the middle and the end. And he needed everybody to know that his God is the only God. Peace that passes understanding is getting stoned and looking up into heaven and seeing Jesus. Oh, being stoned, right? He wasn't getting a, like, a, like a whatever, not being liked on Facebook or whatever it is. I don't know. He was looking into heaven while he was being stoned. Peace that passes all understanding does not make any sense to your mind. I just want peace that passes understanding. Except you're trying to understand it. You know why most Christians don't follow the will of God? It's because what he asks you to do, you cannot do without him. It's free for us. It wasn't free for him. That's why the gospel is so offensive. You literally cannot do it. Have a moment with the Lord. He's going to bring conviction into your life. How about you go ahead and get rid of that thing? Whatever it is. And you get rid of it by repenting of it. Turning away from it to God.